It's so much better than it ever has been because of these products. What's something that works? Try this. It could change your life like it changed mine. Poma here. All right. Let's see here. These guys, she's a, from a family of popaholics. Her husband had yeah. something and I couldn't take care of it. I, know, I felt so bad. Because he had a lipoma. I do believe that was under the muscle because it definitely flexed kind of thing. Yeah. And then I saw this one today and I was like, oh, this one is, if it's a lipoma, it's under there a little bit. Ooh, I think it's a lipoma. Can you grab a black, a rounded tip? There you go. I'm too late. I'm having the baby. <laughs> that was me. That was you. That was you. Was that you the last time? Mm -hmm. Even the last time before that even? No, 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 it was just this last one. Gosh. How scary though. Is that like now scary? Like if you have another one, you're like, I better be real close. Yeah, but that's not happening. <laughs> but I mean, like, were you like scared? Like, you could do it yourself, though, right? Yeah. But it's scary, I guess. Well, you're like, what yeah. the heck? I well, mean, because be honestly, when you get like you get, it's so painful. You feel yeah, like you're you just gonna die. You just have to. You just gotta get it. It's like I'm, almost like I'm serious. just gotta get it out, yeah. right? And once you feel like you can't take anymore, uh -huh. you have. Your we're talking baby. about baby, by the way, not a lipoma. <laughs> <laughs> to the camera, to the camera. <laughs> oh, now we're scaring her though. I've never had a baby. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna squeeze it. See if the baby comes out. Come here, baby. Ah, maybe. Oh, he's soft. He's a soft baby. I don't want to crush him. Come on. Make sure I'm never hurting him. Just use my fingers to kind of loosen him around. Oh, he's cute though. Please come out. Oh, that is so cute. Uh, but yeah, you feel. Do you remember that video of that woman that had the baby in the in the passenger seat? Oh my gosh, she just had to stand up. And her kids are in the back, like, going, what the... Mm -hmm. <clears throat> that looks scary to me. Well, the nurse said that, that right when you feel like you're about to give birth, you, you're going to feel, like, you're going to feel Crushed. nauseous. Yeah. Gosh. Um, she that told me, like, three things. That, that before had, and then you got them all? Yeah, oh and I gosh. actually did get nauseous, and I threw up right before oh, I gave birth. Geez. Yeah. Just pushing it, it really to intense. see if I could squeeze. Really? Mm -hmm. And it was done, and it was mm -hmm. over. But honestly, I would have them all yeah. that way. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Because it's easier care after. Yeah, recovery? Yeah. It wants to tear, so I want to pinch it out a little bit. I'm bracing myself. I can't. Last, oh, there you go. Last one popped out like that. Nice, too. When I least expected it, but it wants to tear, so I'm just trying to tug at it a little bit. Come on. It is like giving birth, though. Terrible, like terrible, <laughs> but tear not. It's it tears easily. You know, yours is like a Dover sole. It's like a delicate fish that wants to. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good description of it. It just I can't pull it very much. It'll just like tear for me. I'm trying to get it all out. Come on, this way. Come to the light. It is actually bigger than it looked, huh? Mm -hmm. A little bit. But almost there, almost got it all. Come on, come on, little one. Come on. You okay? Yeah. Okay, good. Come on. So, what, how long did it take you, baby? Like, it was just minutes and you're done? Mm hmm. Gosh. Once I. Could have blinked and missed it. Yeah. Because they upped my Pitocin, oh. and then they didn't check me, and then when they checked me, I was fully dilated oh and ready to gosh. go. At least you were there and everything, thank God. Why did they have to give you Pitocin if you were? Because I was already um, you were going trying. over, like getting, oh. going over. Time? Mm -hmm. Well, that's what got it. It wasn't like so natural. They actually got it going on. No, you. yeah. 
No, because if he, she would have been baking in there, if they would have been baked and then I wouldn't have like come out. Fit out. Fit out. Yeah. Fit, yeah. yeah. man. She was my tiny baby. Can this one please just pop out? Last little bit. It's not wanted to pop out that easily. I'm gonna wiggle you. I'm gonna start doing that wiggle. Come on. I know I'm tugging on you. Because I'm just trying to wiggle it around. Come on. He's talking to us. Can you just squeeze outside a little bit, maybe massage it? You know? Come on. Oh, I think you're going to be happy this thing's gone. I think yeah, it definitely right. is taking up space here. It laid up and down, down, down this little um, foundation here. Come on. Yeah, he's gonna tear easily, that's all. This is weird, it's talking to us. Come on, come on. You're so close, buddy. Okay, right? Yeah. Okay. I'm dropping all the pieces. I'm gonna just try to pull this part off here again. Let's regroup here. Let's regroup. Let me pick up these pieces here. I'm just gonna use this. All right. Let's see here again. He's still in there. I can feel him still. Kind of thing I can't I can't hit us at it. Oh sorry, 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 sorry. Okay. Thank you for I'm yeah. sorry about that. Yeah. I'm pulling on him and he's tugging on you lower down. Sorry about that. Mm -hmm. Here, hold this underneath. I'm just mm -hmm. gonna put some off pieces there. Because she doesn't she doesn't want me pulling on her. I think if I do that I'll release eventually. Cause it's sort of like a vacuum under there, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's pulling it in so I try to like get some air under there somehow to try to get it pulled out, but if it tugs on you deeper, it just pulls on your muscle and so you feel that. But obviously I'm not going to pull up, take out the muscle, it just kind of tugs on it and that's what you feel. So I guess it's sort of a cross between the two things I thought, like I am kind of scooping some of it out at the end here. But it, it is a lipoma, but it's just, it's uh, not, uh, it's not easy to pull out. It's not like it's one little entity that's easy to pull out. I have to scoop a little bit of it out, unfortunately. But we can do it. It's right in this little casing, right in this area, but I can't. Come this way. Good now. Thanks for getting under there. That feels like it's just stuck at the very bottom here. Let's see if I can use my knees back or something. Let's see if I'll pull out.
folks, you're doing great. wider ones, you know, the, the, like, like that U-shaped or uh, hemostat, I wonder if that would help us. Not in this case, but in the future, you know, when you're grabbing with it. But that's why those surgical techs, you know how they have like a million instruments on the table? Mm -hmm. They have every kind of option. Sorry. You okay? Yeah. Okay, good. That's the bottom of the test. We're getting it now. Just gently trying to pull it away from you. You're doing awesome. You can break from it. Sorry, wrong. I can't grab it and ease it out that easily. But I feel this is it. I know this is still it. Might be good for a good bit, right? See how it was right in this thing? This is this is still it a little bit right here in this little area. Great, almost there. This way, this way, come this way. It's right back in. Yours is a grumpy lipoma. Yeah, it sounds like it. Yeah, he just wants, like, I keep pulling him a little, and he comes, it's like you pull the arm a little, and you're like, come with me. And then it, no, I'm going to ease back in here. It's nice and comfy and toasty here. I'm gonna get this out guys. I'm really gonna ease the rest of this. Okay, it's so crumbly. Come on, this way. I keep thinking, is this still the lipoma? Because it's under there, but it's just a little finger of it. It's getting smaller, smaller.
the analogy goes, you know what I'm talking about when it's a this and that, and you have to like, it's like trying to. Oh, sorry. sorry. Did I get you? Sorry. Yeah, it's just, yeah, just trying to get the little sharp. Oh, a little jab. I'm sorry. I probably tug on you right there. I'm so sorry. But I didn't go anywhere deep or anything. I was just like, I must have tugged on it again. So we're so close. It's like trying to tangle like little fishies from like a net or something. There's some really pretty pieces that initially came out, I'll tell you that. like the last little bit I just have to massage it out a little bit so I'm gonna I never thought I'd be rubbing your butt like this <laughs> here I am <coughs> Last little bit here, just under there while I'm pulling a little bit on you. Sorry about that. Come on. Yeah, see? It, uh, uh huh, good. Good, like that. Just trying to see if it'll come out maybe the way out. Maybe what I was looking for. It did. I, I helped eat it out. We'll just have to do that a few times and I think we'll get it. How are your nieces doing, Valerie? Are they in school? Virtual yeah. school? Yeah. Do they like it or do they hate it? Both? Love um, both, maybe? It's nice to do something, I guess, but... Right. I think it's nice for them to be able to see their friends again. Yeah, but it's a weird thing. I bet you, I'm sure, I don't know how the teachers do that. I don't Keep know. a hold of these little kids. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Bouncing off the wall. There was and a the really funny video. Parents do it too yeah. when you're like yeah. working from home and you have to also yeah. home, like basically you're homeschooling your kids. Right, you are. Yeah, you have to like keep or them you're on. Working and then you have to worry about them actually doing their work. It's almost right. easier. Right. Because I'm like, what about the people that don't yeah, work from home? How do they? Well, how do they make like? I have to get a camera. How are people functioning? Oh, that's what Vernay has. That's yeah, what I'm that's seeing what her I'm... with a camera. Sorry if I'm pushing on you here, but that I found a little hidden piece here hiding. So you have to massage it a little bit and then it comes out. Come on. Nice. Good piece. Yes, that was a very satisfying piece there. Glad we found that one. 
Well, this is going to be your good hip. <laughs> yeah, your sexy hip. You're going to be, sh you know, dr dreading this hip up now. I think this is still, I think this is actually good. I think there's regular fat in here too, and I don't want to take out too much, obviously. I'm just trying to take out just enough. I think this is it. This top little bit here. I want to do that because, because I feel when you push against that, I feel a little bit of a lift. You can see it with your eyes, but and you could I'm sorry, you could feel it with your hands, but you can't necessarily see it with the camera. Like I could I could see how people would be like, where how do you know when to stop? You know? Mm -hmm. But you could feel it. It's weird how you can feel it. I can't describe that how. But it feels different. It's like a, a lump under there. Milk's going straight down, I think, you know? We got a lot of space here, unfortunately. All of us. A lot of space to store things. Okay. Let's just do one more squeeze here. See if anything eases out. Let's put in line there. About here. How would you do this otherwise? Do you have any other options? Like you just have to like make a huge excision. You can't, and it's bound to come back. You know how are you gonna guess? They just go and travel in these different directions. There's no way you could just like try to cut like a wide unless you just cut the whole hip or something. You know? Right? This is I don't. Yeah. I mean, do you think of any other better way to do this? I don't know. I can't. Liposuction? No way. It's gonna. Come it out in pieces. Keep bleeding. <laughs> Been here for a long time. According to that clock, it's only one ten. Can you? Okay. <laughs> Plenty of time. I don't even know why we have that clock in here. <laughs> it's I don't know when's the last time it worked? Just for show. Oh, that looks pretty good. Oh, pretty good. I'm pretty pleased with that. But that was, I got too excited about yours. I was like, oh, it's gonna pop on like a little chicken cutlet. Yeah. But it didn't That's when I get in trouble. <laughs> but it, it still popped out. It's just we had to work at it a little bit. Still work at it just a little bit. Because it's little tiny pieces, I think. That was pretty good though. She's gonna get a little cute little spanks, huh? Okay. <clears throat> that was nice. And I didn't make the scar line that long either. Good. There you go. Take out. I almost feel like you're starting to take out too much. You know what I mean? Like I feel. I don't know. I could do this for a long time, unfortunately. Why is that? It's like it eases out again once you um, massage it. Are you okay? Yep. Okay. Good. Okay. I know I already said that already, but this is really it. deep with you guys, but I don't know what all this crazy stuff is going on in the world in general. I'm really sad today. Crazy world. A lot of mean things happening in the world. And it's like, you know who's right? It's like, why do we have to have, sorry, I'm getting all deep now. Why do we have to have political things?
things going on right now. We've got COVID. I just want to take a vacation. <laughs> I can't, well, you can't even go in there. Yeah. That was a good one. Okay, now I feel pretty good. I was like reaching for this one thing and I feel good with that little peak that came out here. There's little fingers that are trying to get away from us. <laughs> Dive down. All right, I'm good. All right, now I'm good. Now I'm good, now I'm good. Okay, we're gonna put a suturing on there. Girl, we got some stuff out of here. Sure. That's surprisingly I'm, a lot bigger. Yeah, and I'm trying mm -hmm. not to make it, like obviously yeah. naturally. And it's not oozing, so that's always also good. Um, and I think you're gonna put her in like a little uh, lipo, you know what I mean, garment thing. Or did you want me to use like the pantyhose? Uh, I don't know if that's tight here. Yeah, I don't know how tight it is. I think um, we do lipo garments. It's just yeah, that there's two. That's why. The, oh, because uh, it's the under and then the, got the it. compression. So. Um. Uh, I think if you just, I think you can just use the top one, honestly, because they're oh. not wearing, just on this side, and I feel like if you put the, um, what do you call it, the, the netting, do you know what I mean oh. with that? That, that, that should be okay. Okay. As long as, you know, I think you just want to have nice compression on this side, I think. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. You can take a pause right here if you want to, because this is boring well. Yours are later and mine yeah. are later. Later, later, too. later too. Yeah. yeah. I think a lot of schools like are Rachel start real like, yeah. uh, Lopez, her kids yeah. start pretty early. Yeah. I know. I think ours is the latest because ours mm -hmm. is the traditional. Yeah. Like, right after Labor Day. That's like the most traditional, which nobody does anymore, really. Upland. Except for my kids' school. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Upland District starts late, too, though. They, that's they good, though. Like, like even uh, Sierra Vista doesn't start until the end of the month. <clears throat> that's the elementary school. In this case, it's better to be out later, so they see what happens with other schools first. But it's okay. So they only have what school three days a week, uh -huh. starting Wednesday. Really? And only one class a day. What the heck? <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> I mean, this year for everybody is just a wash, really. I okay, they're, they're, they're learning in the world of life. What is it? The the school, the the, the subject of life. Probably not this year. There was a meme that said, "I don't. I'm not. I'm canceling my birthday this year. Yes. I'm not oh, trying to do <laughs> Yeah, that looks good. Mm -hmm. Does it look good? Yeah, I'll show you. We'll show you in a minute, but I'll show you fat here first. Okay. That's like so it was like this is the Portuguese man wore the top of it. It came out oh, all nice. I was like, oh, God. it's gonna be so nice. And then uh, pieces, pieces stuck that like in little huge. nooks. Huge. Yeah, it was pretty big. It was under there." If you even like look down at your hip here, see? Oh my gosh. It's not, yeah. it's swollen a little bit right there. Yeah, but I don't think it's gonna be depressed. It I, was I a handful. Just I just put my hand yeah. on it. Just yeah. like, it was a handful. You see how it tears? Some people's it just, so if I pull this, it'll yeah. just tear. Like if I grab it, so it's suction in. So yeah. I couldn't grab it all out of right. a piece because it would just like do this, you know? That is so gross. <laughs> That's so cute. So that's all lipoma, even the little pieces? Yes, that's all, that was all stuck in there, like the little deep corners. Oh so I had to reach in and put, and it was like in this netting yeah. of your fiber, so I had to like tease it out of like between that spaces. That is crazy how so it's big such a that pain is. like that, yes. <laughs> yeah, you did great though, and it looks nice.